Today on Country Boy Cooking with Marshall, I'm gonna show y'all a hack with these, these jumbo cinnamon rolls. I've seen it all over YouTube. I've seen it all over TikTok. I've made it three or four times so far. I gotta show it to you, it's so good. Let me show you how to put it together today on Country Boy Cooking with Marshall. about an eight by eight round dish right here. I love grape seed oil, y'all. You can make it in anything like that. But first thing I'm gonna do is spray it. Everybody, this is one of the most simple hacks I've ever seen. To take regular cinnamon rolls, make sure you get the grains. And you know how cinnamon rolls are sometimes dry inside and everything? This right here takes care of everything. Y'all check this out. I've got five jumbo cinnamon rolls going in. And right, I've got them all in there in my grease pan right here. Right here's where it gets crazy, everybody. We're going to add some heavy whipping cream to this. But just pour it all on it and coat the whole bottom around a quarter inch. What's this? You can't go wrong. See that? I've got them coated well and I've got a good quarter inch in the bottom of that. Now let's go over here to the burner. Okay, here at the burner, I've got a half a stick of butter, a half a cup of brown sugar, one teaspoon of cinnamon. We're gonna heat this over medium low heat, get it real bubbly, and put it over the cinnamon rolls. Let's do it. Stir it around, get it all melted together. Y'all, you know this part right here is completely optional by the way. You can go ahead and add the heavy whipping cream, bake them around 40, 45 minutes, get them out, put your icing on top, that'd be good enough, but we gotta take it to the next level. Do this with me. Right when it starts getting done, I like to add about a half a teaspoon of vanilla to it also. You can use extract or flavoring. Stir everything well. Look at that. Listen to that. How beautiful. And by the way, if you've never bought a grand cinnamon rolls, it also comes with this little icing pack. I'll show you what to do with it in just a second. Okay, let's pour our butter brown sugar mixture over this. Look, just pour it over it. Okay, see that? Now we're going to put a lemon foil over it. <laughs> that's going in the oven at 350 for around 40 to 45 minutes. Start checking that after around 40 minutes. You want all this good heavy whipping cream to get up in that cinnamon roll, y'all. It's fantastic. I can't wait to show it to you. See it in about 45 minutes. Okay, everybody, they're out of the oven. They're still a little warm. I let them sit about 10 minutes. Let's look at them. Check this out. Here's the big reveal. <laughs> Y'all look how beautiful that is. That cream goes on the inside of these cinnamon rolls, everybody, and makes them so moist. There's no dry cinnamon rolls here. Now let me show you what else I do. Remember the little packet of icing that comes with it? I add about three tablespoons of the heavy whipping cream to that and just mix it up. We're fixing to pour this over this. Look, just pour it over it. Look at that, everybody. You can't go wrong. You just simply can't go wrong. All right, we've got the icing on it. See how beautiful that looks, everybody? We're gonna add one more thing to it. Can you guess? We're gonna be adding finely diced pecans. Why not? Let's add to it. This is all optional. Look, we're just gonna add those pecans to it. Is there any wrong way? This is a half a cup, by the way. All right, look at that, everybody. We're gonna let that sit about five minutes. Let everything sit good. Then we're gonna do a taste test. You've got to see this taste test. Oh my gosh, everybody, look at this. You cannot go wrong with that. I'm telling you, when you add that heavy whipping cream, it makes this cinnamon roll so moist. How many out there has ever had a dry cinnamon roll? They're no fun. These things right here are very moist. Give it a try, look at that. Pecans are optional. Let's taste this. Y'all, this is literally so moist. Even this little sour spatula, look. Cuts it right into. Let's taste it. <laughs> oh my goodness, everybody. Y'all, I'm telling you, this cinnamon roll hack here needs its own love song. It's that fantastic. It really is. Again, y'all, give this a try. Look at that. It can't be beat. Try this hack, everybody. Thank y'all for watching again today on Country Boy Cooking with Marshall, where you know, Jesus is always Lord of all. Y'all give this cinnamon roll hack a try. It's fantastic.